and on this channel I share with you simple recipes from all around the world. And today I will share with you a recipe for a delicious soup made with young beetroots. In Poland it is very popular during spring and summer, but if you aren't Polish, but you feel like trying something new, this is a recipe for you. It is quick, easy and cheap to make and the result is not only delicious, but also it's a real feast for the eyes. As always, check the description box below the video for all the details and make sure that you're subscribed so you don't miss a thing. Okay, let's get started. We will be using the whole plant, the leaves, the stems and the roots. This is a young plant, so the roots are rather small. Another very important ingredient here is the dill, which will give the soup its distinctive taste. I start by peeling all the beetroots. My bundle was made with six medium-sized beets. And two carrots. In order to get them all into small pieces, you can either cut them using a knife or grate them. But I found even a quicker way to do it. I use my mini food processor. I simply cut the veggies into chunks and I turn the blender on and off around 5 times for 3 seconds. And that's it! Quick and mess free! I add the chopped veggies into salted boiling water or vegetable stock. I use 1.5 to 2 liters depending on the size of the beetroot bundle. This one was rather big so I used 2 liters of water. Now I let it simmer under a cover for about 10 minutes. During this time I chop the beetroot stems. When the roots have been cooking for 10 minutes I add the stems, juice from half a lemon and I keep simmering for another 5 minutes while I prepare the leaves. Make sure you give them a good wash to get rid of all the sand that likes to hide there. I chop them a bit so that later they fit better on the spoon. And I throw them all into a frying pan with some melted clarified butter. I season it with salt and I let the leaves sear until they reduce in size. Next I sprinkle them with 2 tablespoons of flour and I mix it. I add one cup of liquid from the cooking vegetables, I stir it once more and I transfer it into the soup pot. The flour will make the soup a little bit thicker. To finish I add finely chopped dill and I make sure that there is enough salt and lemon juice. I also sometimes add one tablespoon of maple syrup to bring up the natural sweetness of the beetroot. I bring it once more to a boil and I turn the heat off. Now I add half a cup of cream and oh, this is my favorite part. Just look at this vibrant color. Traditionally in Poland we serve it with a boiled egg, freshly ground pepper and potatoes. For me this tastes like summer on the plate. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you'd like to stay up to date with all my newest step-by-step -step recipes, do subscribe to my channel and click the bell so that you are notified when my newest videos are out. Thank you for watching until the end and I hope to see you soon. Bye!